Oh, I'm level 400. Oh, nice. Hell yeah. I'm about to show you guys how I level really fast. Like, really, really fast. I'm, what level were you when you started? 50. 50, right? Today, when I hit you up? Yeah. And look what level he is now. He's level 265. He just came here at level 50. I'm gonna give you guys the perfect method. I'm telling you, no one's trying to show you guys how to level like this. What is going on everyone it's your boy and we are on the plus ultra 2 and uh to be honest i did record an intro and all this stuff i recorded so much footage beforehand but then i just decided hey you got everything bro you stayed up all night you grinded I was late on this originally like i think i jumped on it probably nine hours after it dropped because i, I stayed up all night stupidly my sleep schedule is really bad today i stayed up all night grinding this game now as you guys can tell from the title of the video i'm going to be showing you guys the best and i'm telling you the best methods bro i'm inside the youtube YouTuber server right now currently as we speak and i haven't even seen the other youtubers using this i'll explain more once we get in the game anyways you guys see the game passes here do me a favor buy this right here that's donation to the game look these devs are lit two people are working on this game show them some love you feel me start spamming the likes on the game bro we get a new code at 90k likes you feel me second quirk you gotta get that in my opinion because level 800 i haven't even reached level 800 i'm probably halfway there honestly buying this i got to have my second quirk get the move around fast you guys will see what i'm talking about second boss drops i paid for that because i want to get this stuff faster for you guys so i can show you guys blah 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 i'm gonna be copying this you already know make my aura better color fast juice it lets me take out enemies way faster because i'm charging up my i almost said chakra charging up my juice they call it in this yeah let me just show you guys exactly how to level and uh yeah we're gonna get right into this guys and we also have some codes for you guys as well now the thing is i did enter them earlier i'm probably just gonna take that footage and put it over if i don't do that it's gonna say use but anyways let's get right into this so all right so we got the server with all our youtubers let's just go up in here and show you guys how to level wow so i'm gonna keep it real i just recorded like probably 15 minutes of info for you guys i'm, I'm freaking mad <laughs> Woo! but look we're just gonna redo it and hopefully you guys get it okay and hopefully i say exactly everything that i said before all right so you go to store and then you go to cheat codes so for the first code the first code is capital g a m E capital R E L E A S E exclamation mark and that will give you guys I'm not sure what that'll give you guys but um here's the second code the second code will give you guys two times exp I'm pretty sure for 10 minutes or something like that so the code is capital T H A N K capital Y O U exclamation mark and uh, that should work here let me retype that O U exclamation mark and it said code to use see I got two times exp right now that is active hopefully that helps you guys out and you guys enjoy that anyway so let's say you were starting off right here hold up let me make sure we're recording okay we are so you're starting off you want to talk to realm mad right here or realm mighty talk to him um let me just do the quest so you guys can see it real you want to talk to him real quick depending on if you have double xp or not you want to just keep grinding this like over and over again you just want to grind this over and over again once you kill all enemies within the square the quest is complete now if anyone is just doing this quest all you got to do is just come in hit it one time or do some well don't just hit it one time get some damage into it first and then once that's complete as long as you guys don't go to another quest or something you should get the exp for it so um do this a whole bunch of times get yourself up to i'd say level 10 or something like that something decent you know do this quest a couple times till you do that then what you guys want to do is you want to come over here and uh also i suggest you guys run with some friends some people don't have friends to run with look there's the discords there's a lot of discords where people are running with each other there's people always playing this game so you will see people playing in the public servers fear not you will always have people to play with i'm pretty sure once you're level 20 you want to come here it'll start a quest right here another square will come up right here everyone just got to kill everything inside there you'll usually see people just attacking that like all day like there will be people training there all day so what you want to do is just keep attacking that kill everything in the middle get your exp grind up once you guys have done that a lot of times like i don't know how many times you guys are gonna have to do it also you're not restricted to like doing the quest just because you're not the level uh required to do the quest to be honest like let's say you're level 20 but you're stuck on here but your friends are actually let's say doing um the quest over here let's say they're doing the quest over here you can actually go and join them 
get really good exp you could actually i don't know if it's the same exp they get but you can get really good exp for just participating inside the event so for instance they can go here click this right here two squares right here now everyone in the circle you'll see people here all day like i said fighting so all you guys gotta do is run in there attack something you'll get exp once everything inside the square is killed simple like that you'll get 18k from this one right here so it's it's pretty simple you know two squares not that hard once you guys get yourself to around level 50 what you guys want to start doing is you want to come over to bakugo this will be the first npc boss that you'll be able to actually like get a quirk from if you guys didn't know that you get the actual quirks from the show from the bosses in the game you come up here level 50 talk to bakugo right here or you talk to a guy who wants to face bakugo and then um i don't know why i started that i probably just messed i have people farming people are farming in the in the server right now so they're gonna want this and i just used it it takes five minutes to come back i don't know if that's for everything what you want to do is you want to kill bakugo once you kill bakugo you have a chance of getting his gauntlets as an item as an actual accessory that can boost your stats you can get his clothing that also boosts stats as well or you can get his quirk or all three you can get them all they're all like different rarities and whatnot but yeah if you get the quirk new quirk stuff is coming out um later today so that's why i'm waiting on doing these showcases i don't want to do these showcases when they're not complete yet with uh everything that could be with the quirk i feel like i'm just rambling at this point but you guys need to know this information the other bosses will be able to get an accessory usually an accessory that is uh like say deku's uh gloves or deku's like souls or whatnot you know what i'm saying something for his hero costume and basically with this when you click three you see how it says costume right then i do this it puts on the costume that you currently have all the stuff that you have so right now i have denki shades on that's from kaminari denki um i have deku's um gloves right here you know i got todoroki's clothes right here and they're all giving me different stat boosts and stuff to my character it's really neat where you can mix and match all the different stuff for your playstyle and then you go like that to take it back off but yeah that's pretty much it for that and whatnot also you have a time limit and if you fail the time limit you're gonna have to redo it so it's good to have friends or just fight anything that you see another opponent fighting for real once you guys are level 50 what you guys want to do is you guys want to come over to i'd say you want to come over to this person right here now this person will give you a quest where you have to fight a dude named cabbage uh head or something like cabbage man i don't know what it is anyways he gives you a cabbage head i don't think he gives you a quirk or uh clothing i know that he gives you a cabbage head because i've received that myself other than that i don't know what he gives you i don't even know he looks like zetsu from naruto to be honest if you guys know who that is but you guys want to kill this dude go between bakugo and this dude for level one and you can also do this while waiting in between because uh, you guys have to wait in between bosses like i said you should be strong enough you know to venture out to other quests that you see other people attempting to take so for instance like when I was around these levels, I would go out to over here towards the beach and I would see Kaminari right there. Now you click Kaminari right there, Denki, and you can fight him right there. Get his quirk, clothes, or his shades. He has bracers as well. So he has like four different items I think you can, you can get from him. So a lot of these bosses have cool items. You guys just got to get, look, it's something really cool to the game. You see that quest all the way in the back, level 100 and something, uh, 50, I don't know, something like that. It's not worth it. It only gives you guys 2k exp totally not worth it sponge the yacht in the back though it's, it's kind of cool like that i like the yacht the sponge but the exp is just not good it's not as cheap let's say you, you get yourself up you grind yourself up you're feeling kind of stuck around 50 to 80 and all that well like i said you guys should be helping with any fights you guys see any heroes you guys see start helping any person that's fighting stuff because that's guaranteed exp to you and if you're running double xp even better just half the time it's gonna take now once you guys are in public servers i guarantee you guys you will see you guys remember the two squares i showed you over there that give you eighteen thousand cash right if you guys come over here, this quest right here will start giving you guys some of the best EXP you'll see in the game. So right here, level 125, probably like, well, Desi, I'm not level 125. Again, other people will be doing this quest. Just find a server where people are doing this quest. Go and fight the enemies they're fighting, and you guys will receive some fast EXP. It's like some really, really good EXP. I'm gonna keep it real. Like you got like people actually helping and people grinding a whole bunch of people in the server 
for this one right here you have three squares instead of the two over there that's why i said go over there if you guys have problems with this one right here you kill all three of them a tip that my friend was giving me is that if you guys go like this you can actually push them together and whatnot the longer that you take the push um the characters and whatnot together i mean the, the less efficient this method is as you know like uh time is essence we put all the characters like together like this and what we want to do is make sure that if you're coming in here you want to get one hit and then have someone just pop off an aoe move of some sort like for instance this one right here you see that i don't know why that didn't kill them but they're not trying to kill me either it's weird right then i do another one and uh my friend i don't know when he does it he like kills everything in one hit but that's not happening for me today i'm not getting that kind of luck but anyways, you kill this one over here, then you kill everyone on this square, and then you kill everyone in this square, and that would net you guys 22,000 EXP times two. You do the math, that's 44K. That's a lot of EXP for you guys right there. Now, let's say you gotten yourself all the way up here to the point where you can actually start doing this yourself. Then you guys wanna start helping your friends. Your friends will actually help you get this stuff done quicker. So I tell you, help people. Help people help you, you feel me? Once you're level 125, you can actually start doing the quest over here Uravity. she's over here she's behind that rock you can do her at 125 you fight Uravity right here and uh deku in the back and you get deku stuff back there zero gravity stuff right here you guys you guys know the drill i'm not trying to explain everything you, you feel me you're doing those you're grinding back and forth there's also the sand area over there where at level 220 over in that direction over there you can get yourself some half hot half cold and uh that's actually two quirks you can get from todoroki and from what i've noticed it's very rare to get stuff off of todoroki like i've only gotten costumes off him then i finally got the fire version my friend just got the ice version off of him so you can get two quirks off of todoroki apparently that's pretty cool now there is a quest out there that gives you 50k for doing a hostage and all this i've done a couple tests on a few of the other places and honestly guys i'm gonna keep it real with you guys you guys want to know how i level and how i personally been grinding my levels up like crazy we're about to show you you guys want to see how i grind my levels like crazy let's do a speed run let me go grab my friends and I'll show you guys exactly what I'm talking about. Also, if I didn't mention this earlier, flying with uh, Mutant. Let me show you real quick. When we go to skills right here and we go to quirk and we do create ability. What you guys want to do is you want to have area effects and you want to have it as big as you can. This is the must stuff right here. As big as you can. The higher the level, by the way, will let you make it bigger. But make it as big as you can. You do uh, block. Then you want to make sure explosion fx is as high as you can like i said higher level the more you could do everything else is pretty much just like cosmetic or however you want to make it customize it how you want but make sure that you do area effects size 44 and above just keep making it as much as you can explosion fx make sure that's the max create yourself an ability now once you create that create a couple of those guys i'm telling you create a couple of those create a couple lasers as well you guys want to have a couple lasers the way i got lasers is because i got emitter as well for my first quirk creating a with this yeah just do range with this and do something of the same sort make yourself a laser ability uh something like this let me show you guys what i'm talking about like this a beam currently i put three beams or more the more stuff that's able to go around it splits the damage up but it's able to hit more stuff so i highly recommend you guys get that get yourself a couple beams that you can just pop off really quickly and then um I'm about to show you guys how I level really fast, like really, really fast. I'm sorry that this is not as in-depth as it should be. Like you guys know, I normally do really in-depth guides, but honestly, it didn't record properly. I'm gonna give you guys the perfect method. I'm telling you, none of the other YouTubers know about this method right now. There's no YouTubers at the spot that I'm gonna show you. And we are actually inside of a YouTuber server right now. We're inside a YouTuber server where there's a whole bunch of YouTubers and not one YouTuber is chilling at that spot. The only person who's chilling at that spot is my Stone Gang member, Ome, and we're gonna show you guys how to do this quick leveling all right yeah, yo, <laughs> meet me over at the place we're gonna just do this video quick all right so this is the area right here where we found out we can get like lots and lots of exp right here now, as i said earlier before this is a youtuber server like basically every youtuber is in here that's making videos on here where do you see anyone right here right right now they're all grinding and they don't even realize that this is the spot correct me if i'm wrong anyone who's a high level like myself knows that over there is a quest for 50k times two exp it's 100k and it's a hostage one there's all these other ones over there there is a quest like this one right here that's over there in the forest that gives you 40k but like i said last time i did it there was a strong enemy bro and it just took way too long to destroy him 
and I can get two of these done within the time period I get that one done. So we'll check to see if that works later on. But for right now, this is the main spot that we're going to be grinding on. You're going to come up this guy, Tuchi Sakugo. You got to be level 175. I know you guys are probably like, what the hell? But like I said, go up to people who are just doing it. You'll probably go into a server, see someone doing it. Just run up to them and start hitting the people that they're hitting. Because like, what level were you when you started? 50. You were like level 50, right? Today when I hit you up? Yeah. And like he had like no EXP, bro, no double XP, and look what level he is now. He had a 10 minute double EXP from uh, the code and whatnot. But aside from that, he level 265, bro, and he just came here at level 50. So you don't have to be level 175. You just gotta show up, hip stuff that other people are hitting. But uh, yeah, let's just show you guys. I'm gonna get myself to 400. Let's get myself to 400, bro. I'm gonna show how fast we can do yeah, this. Yeah, let me do the first hit. All right, so like I said, guys, you guys wanna have an AOE with the block and all that stuff. And uh, so I'm gonna pop my block right, or my AOE right here. Pop my other AOE right here. And then you wanna have some lasers just to hit them off. You know what I'm saying? I might speed this up just so you guys can, uh, oh, crap, crap. Okay, so normally there's like one or two big mans who think they're the, Bro, can we kill that? Like, what's going on? Why is it not getting hit? See, this is, this is an issue I have with the game sometimes. Sometimes it doesn't feel like you're hitting stuff. But anyway, you see 33,000 EXP right there. Just from that. That annoying quest over there. Like, that gets annoying, like, after a while. It's still good EXP, but it gets annoying, bro. If that's all you have. That ain't gonna give you, like, this much. Deku gives you 22k for killing him. People are gonna tell you, fight bosses to level. It's not the way, bro. It's not the way. Watch how fast I level this up. Hey, you wanna do me a favor, old man? And just keep like starting up the mission and whatnot. I'm gonna grind up to okay. 400 and show them like uh, a time lapse, a speed, like, you know, of me just doing this. So, you guys wanna basically just defend the truck. If you guys do not defend the truck fast like we are doing right now, they will start destroying the truck. You can do this with one person, it, it can get like hard in the beginning, but I suggest what you guys do is let's say, for me, my main stat point that gets two points every time I put it in is strength. I haven't decided to put any into that yet. Quirk is what I'm putting into right now. Once you have around 300 in the quirk, you're pretty much good to start like destroying anything. You're pretty much good with your quirk. That's pretty much everything you need in order to do this. Bro, watch when I, I craft the new ones. I'm going to craft new skills, man. And they're going to be able to do so much more damage. Oh, crap. See you always got the tough one, the, the one tough dude who thinks he's the boss. You got him? Alright. Look at that, bro. See, this is the big boss right here. They're annoying. Those guys, you don't want to let them hit you. They'll just knock you back and they'll, like, throw you around just causing you more issue and whatnot. It looks like slow leveling for me right now, guys. But usually I run with, like, double XP and as well. Like, I'm really high level right now. Like, it's going to take a minute to grind. Here, let me see if I can try to do this as fast as I can for them. Oh, there's a guy up on here. He's gonna mess up the flex. Oh, that's you. Damn, I shot at you, bro, thinking you were the people. That's funny. Bro. And plus, you stand up here, you're on a... Whoa, who the... See, look at that. They always gotta be big. Look, look, the big ones always gotta be extra. They always gotta be extra, bro. I'm telling you. Yo, how can we keep bringing them out there? If you guys uh, bring them out there, it'll just take it longer or whatnot. So try to keep everything around the car. I mean, if the car's about to break, yeah, bring them out there. But that's about it. Hey, Goddess, are you a hero? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I just bought 12 hours yeah. of double XP for a thousand Robux. Hey, Goddess, um, so let's go make it. you a villain real quick so we don't attack you. Are you all villains? Yeah, we're all villains. I like being a hero. No, Bruh. no, you don't. Yeah, but we might one shot you. Hmm. Oh my God, there's a duck here. Them ducks are evil, bro. Bro, the ducks are not playing. Wait, where is? Yeah, it? we could. I'm stuck under the car. You're stuck under the car. Under the <laughs> Crazy. Oh, Whoa! Just that happened. guy is big, bro. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, we're gonna go check that out right now. I'm gonna head over there. All right. 
This is basically it gives you 40,000 instead of 33,000. It's like a quest, just like the truck quest. Um, we're gonna, t I've only tested it out one time. Like everything else was really easy to kill, except for the one person was taking hella long. I don't know if that was a fluke, like they just had armor or some NPC spawned in. If it doesn't have that every single time, then I say that this is probably the better one to go to. Yeah, depending on how this goes, we'll decide on um, if this is the place to grind or the truck. But just know that it's one of those spots, okay? Also, you already know, spam the likes on the video, guys because like bro look at my time on my exp bro i just bought 12 hours bro for a thousand i've been buying so much exp in this and whatnot waiting for the stone gang run you gotta be level 250 for this one though so that's why i kind of like the other one compared to this one most people don't even get the 250 you know i mean well the game's just yeah you know what i mean that quest is a uh, uh like it's a hostage quest or something like that oh all right so is everyone here Where's Ren? She's invisible. She's up here. Bro, she, she had to be the invisible girl. <laughs> so the dead. invisible engine. See if this is better, because last time I did it, I cleared everything pretty quickly. But, bro, there's this one duck man, and he was pretty serious, man. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. See, it's pretty, it's pretty easy to hit a lot of stuff at once. But if there's, like, one one like npc that's super strong then i don't know might not be worth it is it that guy yeah that guy took a full-on hit from me you know what this could be faster when i did it on my own it was kind of, it took a little longer but this could be faster just because it hits more stuff around but it, we can't all be on the same boxes you know what i mean that's the one downside. You can't really stand on top of the truck, like the truck thing. Oh, I'm gonna kill that big guy. Get out of here. That's why I have the beams specifically for the big guys like that. Yeah, honestly, nah. This this is the the quest right here, guys. This is the quest right here. I don't know why I had a crazy duck that like ruined the experience the first time I did it, but this is the quest right here. So anything <laughs> that I said, uh, with the the car. I mean, if, if you have lower levels and whatnot, you definitely want to go over there. But if you've reached past 250 or you got someone that can bring you out here, then yeah, you should probably do this one right here. Thing is, though, yeah. people who come here should be able to defend themselves because only one person is going to be able to stand in the middle. The person that's doing the most damage with AOE and like that the team is relying on should be in the middle or even a squishy person who's, who can do a lot of damage. This is not a good spot if you if you guys keep spreading out. That's another reason why I kind of like the other spot because I can just like have you guys all step on the car while I just like hit most of the stuff. And then we just clear them up after. This spot can be a little bit more complicated, but if uh, you got everything proper, you can get yourself an extra 7k EXP. And sometimes it can be quicker than the other stuff. Dog, like I'm trying to get up on here. I'm getting hit. That's really annoying. Oh, I'm level 400. Oh, nice. Hell yeah. You guys think this is it, or you think the the car is it? Cause I feel like y'all having to interact with the oh, NPCs God. way more here. Where with the car, we can just stand on top of the car. But yeah, that's pretty much it with um the video on how to level up and whatnot. Want to do Deku? We can do Deku. Damn, why is she running like so fast? Anyways, yeah, this is pretty much the spots where you want to be leveling or the truck. I'm telling you, the, the truck, I might go back to the truck, guys. More control and be able to just level faster if you got a, a really good AOE quirk and like your team's not that uh, strengthened up yet. If you have a good, good follow-up team, come here. You got a lot of AOE and your team's like set, come here. But yeah, that's pretty much it with the video. Your boys, level 406, you guys see me leveling pretty fast. It's the fastest method right here on YouTube. Because it's the fastest method, you guys should definitely spam the likes on the video right now. If this helped you, please, like for real. Like, don't just watch the video and be like, oh, yo, Desi got the hookup. I'm not gonna like, nah, like, drop the like on the video, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, show your boy some love. Uh, no homo. We're gonna make way more videos on this. Let me know what quirks do you guys want me to showcase. Like, we got some new stuff, like the new AP shot, new explosion stuff, uh, new Deku stuff, new electrification stuff coming to the quirks. What do you guys wanna see? me do we got explosion zero gravity full cowling half hot electrification i'm gonna go get the cold side of todoroki i'm gonna go get that because i heard you can get that from todoroki let me know in the comments down below what course you guys want to see me showcase and yeah if you guys like this video you already know drop a like subscribe if you guys are new and until next time guys peace out <laughs>